strategy execution and complexity, thriving in the era of disruption, is a book about the 12 different approaches organizations use to execute strategy in dynamic settings. Why did we write this book? Our understanding of strategy execution has evolved over the last 30 years, from identifying the factors for successful strategy execution to integrating these factors into cause and effect frameworks to guide strategy execution. These frameworks have further evolved in recent years to become a clear set of processes and principles for executing strategy. A number of different strategy execution processes or strategy making processes have emerged within academic research, within practitioner books and within practice. However, to date, research has not captured and documented all the different processes in use and tested their effectiveness in different organizations and settings. In our five-year study of these different strategy execution processes or approaches, we undertook a comprehensive review of academic research, practitioner books and articles, as well as of unique managerial practices, so we could identify all these different processes and approaches. In our book, we identify and discuss more than 12 different processes used to execute strategy in different settings. These include Number 1. The Execution Premium Process, based on Dr. Robert Kaplan and Dr. David Norton's research. Number 2. The Seven Factor Process, based on Professor Febzi Akumu's research. Number 3. The Hoshin Planning Process, also known as Hoshin Kanri or Lean Strategy Deployment which originated from efforts that drove Japan's dramatic transformation and rebuild following the Second World War. Number four, the change acceleration process, based on Dr. John Cotter's research. Number five, the resource allocation process, based on Dr. Joseph Bauer's research. Number six, the simple rules process, based on Dr. Kathleen Eisenhardt and Dr. Donald Sull's research. Number seven, the strategic learning or learning on the run process, for example, see Dr. Willie Peterson's research. Number eight, the talent scouting process, a process we unexpectedly discovered to be used for strategy execution in practice, with corroborating academic literature on Mavericks and Maverick leaders backing up why it would work. Number nine, the outcomes and incentives communication process, another process we unexpectedly discovered to be used in practice with corroborating literature on incentives-based management and performance management. Number 10, project management processes. These included highly structured methodologies like the Project Management Body of Knowledge, PRINCE2, Agile Project Management, Extreme Project Management, and others. Number 11, the performance monitoring and coaching process. This was yet another process we unexpectedly discovered to be used for strategy execution in practice, with corroborating academic literature on experiential learning and performance coaching. Number 12. The Lean Startup and Agile Innovation Processes, based on lean thinking and or agile manifesto values, principles, and tools. In strategy execution and complexity thriving in the era of disruption, we explain the detailed dynamics of each process, the strengths and limitations of each process, the unique role and activities it requires strategic leaders to perform, and how employees at all hierarchical levels and in all parts of the organization can maximize their contribution to strategy within the process. We also explain the common traps with each process, the common employee frustrations and how to overcome them. We provide a case study of each process in action, as well as data on the effectiveness of each process across sectors, industry, and organization sizes. We also discuss and benchmark the effectiveness of each process across different types of complex environments. We're confident the book will become a seminal strategy book. Research for this book. The research for this book was made up of five stages occurring over five years. In stage one, we reviewed all the relevant academic journals and research books on strategy execution to identify processes proposed by strategy researchers. In stage two, we reviewed all the relevant practitioner books and articles on strategy execution to identify processes proposed by practitioners, by strategy execution and change consultants, and by strategy or change advisors. 
In Stage 3, we undertook in-depth case study interviews with executive, middle management, and frontline employees across 13 different types of organizations. Within each organization, we selected people from different parts of the value chain and asked them to describe how strategy execution occurred at their organization. In Stage 4, we undertook wider cross-sectional surveys of 242 executive, middle management, and frontline employees in 80 different organizations and asked them to confirm the extent to which the strategy process is identified in the research, in practitioner books, and in the Stage 3 case study interviews were in use at their organization. Finally, in Stage 5, we used structural equation modeling combining regression analysis, confirmatory factor analysis, and path analysis to test how changes in key variables impacted perceived strategy execution effectiveness. The key variables we tested were the types of strategy processes used, the extent to which strategic leadership were carried out, the types of complexity faced, strategy execution barriers anticipated by employees, and employees anticipated strategy execution effectiveness. This enabled us to provide data on the effectiveness of particular strategy execution processes and of carrying out or not carrying out particular strategic leadership in different types of organizations and different types of complex settings. Our research process and findings were peer-reviewed by leading strategy researchers. We invite you to continue the conversation with us by subscribing to our curated Strategy Execution Resource Guide at www.strategyandcomplexity.guide, where you will find the latest strategy execution research, as well as curated strategy execution books, articles, case studies, tools, definitions, and our blog.